Welcome into the recap of the Bears' first round of the 2024 NFL Draft. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by your Chicagoland Chevy dealers. They are the official truck partner of the Chicago Bears. All right, let's get into this. Caleb Williams, we've been talking about it for months. It is official. He is the Bears' quarterback. Pick number one in the 2024 draft. I was at Soldier Field for several hours tonight, hosting there from the draft party. It was amazingly electric. Packed house, super cool. People were fired up when the commissioner strode up to that podium and said, with the first pick in the 2024 NFL Draft, Chicago Bears select Caleb Williams, quarterback. USC, that place went insane. Insane. Now, what are we getting in Caleb Williams? You're getting a guy who, A, loves football, B, a guy who is unbelievably talented both off-platform and in the pocket. And you're getting a guy who is looking to be the face of a franchise and feels like he is built for this team, for this city, for this moment. So he's going to be here tomorrow, and we'll hear from him. And then he gets right to work. I was with Tremaine Edmonds from the Bears tonight, and he said, look, when he get, he should enjoy today and tonight, enjoy tomorrow morning, fly into Chicago, feel like, hey man, I'm here, I'm home, this is where I belong now. He said, then you get to work. Here's the playbook, let's go. And that's how you win a locker room. You win the locker room, he said, by coming in, putting your nose down, and going to work. That's it, just bury yourself in your book, get in the weight room, get to know your teammates. He said, I think we're going to be just fine. A bunch of guys have already gotten to know him. And have hung out with him, have had dinner with him, have worked out with him. Both DJ Moore and Keenan Allen did that. And then with the second pick, the Chicago Bears got Roma Dunze. Big time wide receiver. University of Washington. A really, really physical receiver. Runs really well. He's athletic. But he's really good at contested catches. Uh, Malik Neighbors was the fastest of the three receivers. Marvin Harrison probably the most polished of the three top receivers, but Roma Dunze, a really good player, and a guy who I truly respect his ability to recognize talent at wide receiver, Tom Waddle, said in watching him, he really liked his route tree and his ability to be a precise route runner. That's something Keenan Allen's really good at, and that's something that DJ Moore's really good at. So you would think the three of those dudes together should make for one scary wide receiver room. Now, the Bears will go back to work on Friday and have a pick in the third round. They do not have, at this present time, a second round pick. My thought is there's a lot of defensive players still on the board. You had first 14 picks in this draft were offensive players, six quarterbacks in the top 12. It's never happened before. So with all these defensive dudes still on the board, do the Bears try and zoom back up into the second round to see if they can get an edge rusher or a three technique? It's a very, very interesting question. Either way, it's an amazing night to be a Chicago Bears fan. Amazing. You've got a generationally talented franchise quarterback. Now you got to develop them. And now it's got to take the next step and get going. That's what we're doing, man. We're chasing greatness. And if you'd like one of these, I was with Bears players tonight. They're like, dude, where'd you get that? I want one of those. Yeah, that's right. You can get them, thecapman.com. Just place your order and I'll get it right out in the mail to you. Chasing greatness. That's what we are doing. Now, again, they have the second round pick that they used to trade to Mont get Montez Sweat. They do have their third rounder. We'll see if they get an offensive lineman. Maybe they trade up to get Jackson Powers Johnson the center. Either way, it's a great freaking night to be a Bears fan. Enjoy the 2024 draft because the Bears had a great night. Take that.